Heather bought herself some cam lock carabiners. And we're gonna see how well they work. So you take her around, clip it. And I suppose that would just tighten up like so. We'll go to the other side. First time I've ever used these, so I have no idea. Around the tree, put it back on and pull the access, pull the access, pull the access, I'm on the wrong side. Alright, that's a good height I guess. I guess that works. And if it's not tight enough, you can do it on either side. It's a camo. Come to this one, I'll show you even better. You loosen it up. So you can see, it's loose. And when you go to pull, it goes into this cam. Oh, sorry. Got my hand in the way. A little bit more. And it just keeps getting tighter. That's good. It works. Or you put a loop on here and connect the cam to the loop. Either way. I don't know whether I've got enough string to do it on this side or not. Let's try it on this side. it over, pull it out through, put your cam on it, pull your cam tight. Well, you can play a tune. Heather's choice. Found me this frog tug rain jacket at the dollar store for four bucks. And where it looks like we're gonna need it. It's a thundering. It's raining. It's raining. Great. A cool little bag. Let's push it down to much smaller. Weird material. This is a small medium. It's got a hood, a snap on hood. Wow, for four bucks. And this is at the dollar store in Canada. Yep. Dollarama, if you want to be precise. Snaps well. and a zipper. And drawstring around the top. We'll put it on. And a drawstring around the bottom. Wow. You can't get much better than that. Elasticized wrists. No pocket though. That's the only downside. Well, I think for a small woman, small, medium would fit. And you're wearing a sweater, too. I'm wearing a sweatshirt. There you go. <laughs> That's not 
that. I got long arms. Yeah, and it's, you could almost cover your hands. So it'd be good for mosquitoes. And you could still probably get a jacket underneath. A light newsletter. jacket, maybe. I don't think you'd need it, though. I think it would hold the uh, heat in, but it's also breathable. It says, packable and washable, Frog Togs patented waterproof and breathable material, recyclable polypropylene materials, no PCV or sweaty sticky films, the color is royal blue, and it's packable and washable. And we're not going to read the French. Elongated rear cape for better rain coverage. Cover your butt. Yes, but they forget a woman's butt sticks out a little more than a man's. And this is a woman's jacket. Yeah, it should have been just a little bit more. Small to medium, chest is 40 to 44, sleeve is 33 and a half, and a large, extra large is 46 to 50, sleeve is 34 and a half. So there you go. If you're looking for a raincoat that's cheap. Four bucks. Yep. There you go. Bring it on. Yeah, it does. <laughs> Happy camping weekend. It's raining. Hey, we might actually do Dano's challenge. Lighting a fire in the rain. Only downfall. We gotta be careful with where we put stock in here. We're in the holy teepee. Um and I got drift on. Don't light the whole thing. Why? I mean, why? Why? That is one whole bar of magnesium. You got it good? You only get one shot at this. Happy Labor Day weekend, everybody. Boy, that's bright. Yep. Almost need welding goggles. And that's how you light a fire in the rain. Yeah. That's hot enough to melt steel.
a white flame. I don't care how wet your wood is. If you got that much magnesium, it's gonna burn. <laughs> 